Good morning, and thanks for tuning in to CNN, the Camp News Network, where accuracy is not a priority. I'm Phil McCup, and I'm Chip Och my shoulder. Susan, Susan, Och. At the top of the news, there's been a massive jellyfish outbreak along Panama City Beach, Florida. It is due to a U.S. Navy experimental warfare project gone awry. The jellyfish are genetically engineered to be extremely belligerent and attack at the sound of a chirping hamster. If stung, rub butter directly on the skin and get plenty of sunlight. We received breaking news last night that Idlewild camper Andy Zunz reportedly received the worst welt in history from a towel pop to the rear. He has since been transported to ICU at Panama City General and is receiving intense draining to the wound area. Wow. Police deployed mustard gas and smoke grenades this morning after residents complained of chanting on the beach. Speculation points toward gang activity. The Environmental Protection Agency has been called to the Laguna Beach private pool area today as scum buildup has reached an all-time high. It is believed that the yellow team's excessive use of hair products has led to this buildup. We had a scare earlier today, but everything is all right now. We thought we had an incident to where a girl stuck into the boy's shower, but later found that the loofah, exfoliant, and Venus razor products only belonged to camper Billy Olson. Reportedly, there was a riot outside the Panama City Maximum Security Facility last night in which several prisoners escaped. These prisoners are said to be wearing brightly colored bandanas on their heads and other parts of their bodies, like their shins. The band formerly known as Chris and Conrad has put out an APB for their missing mineral water. The water, said to have went missing after worship this morning, is extremely valuable. They use the minerals, which are squeezed from a baby seal's sweat glands, to open up their vocal cords. In other band news, Chris has decided to go into the veterinarian field, and Conrad will go on a solo career. His first album will in fact be a Britney Spears cover album. The 2008 Beachside Belly Flop Contest champion Charles Bayless has been released from ICU today after sustaining a stomach rupture following Monday night's indulgence in a carrot, broccoli, and a cherry flavored Tic Tac. Thanks for tuning in to CNN, the Camp News Network, where accuracy is not our first priority. Stay tuned for words from our sponsors. And we're up. Well, goodness gracious, can someone fill my cup? I thought that show went splendidly. This is ridiculous. Susan, good job. I don't like that, Susan. I swear she puts rat poison in my coffee every morning.